Good evening, this is Dr. Do again. This video is uh, for outside of medicine. Continue with the reading Psalm. Uh, today I'm aware uh, I'm going to read Psalm 20. Okay, I'm going to read it. For the director of music, a Psalm of David. May the Lord answer you when you are in distress. May the name of the God of Jacob protect you. May he send you help from the secretary and grant you support from Zion. May he remember all your sacrifices and accept your burnt offerings. May he give you the desire of your heart and make all your plans succeed. We will shout for joy when you are victories, victorious, and we will lift up our banners in the name of our God. May the Lord grant all your requests. Now I know that the Lord saves his anointed. He answers him from his holy heaven and the saving power with the saving power of his right hand. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord our God. They are brought to their knees and fall, but we rise up and stand firm. O Lord, save the king. Answer us when we call. So this is uh, Psalm 20. Um, again, we do not know when or under what circumstances uh, he wrote this. Uh, from the tone, uh, from the uh, reading it, we know he's praising a king and uh, uh, saved the king, answered uh, and uh, God saved the anointed. Looks like, it's my guessing, if you recall, after David uh, um, defeat the Goliath, Goliath the, uh, the Philistine giant, remember, uh, nobody can defeat him. He's very tall, and David used the slingshot to uh, to uh, shoot him at the forehead, and he was he was dead. And so, since then, David was uh, a, a, um, a, a company Saul. Uh, surround him to play harp for him, play music for him. So, uh, from reading this, this is what I guess. This probably he uh, wrote down this uh, lyrics and somebody uh, director of music to compose it, and he sings to Saul to comfort him. If you remember, Saul was having the headache, very stressful, um, uh, always feel lost control and several times tried to uh, kill, uh, kill David because he, I think he probably saw was in uh, severe distress a lot of things going on um, so that's um, so this from what I guess it's probably David singing this to Saul because he mentioned about the king the anointed and the uh, wishes and uh, they hope God will bless him that's very likely. Again, I did not say it. I, this is just my guessing. But anyway, we'll read it. It looks like it's a greeting or a praise or a, a pray for someone. So, may the Lord answer you when you're in distress. May the name of the God of Jacob protect you. See, um, I just uh, pray for you. May the God be with you. May uh, you be protected under the uh, name of God. May he send you help from the secondary and grant you support from Zion. May the God give you strength from Zion. And may he remember all your sacrifices and accept your burnt offerings. Uh, again, um, may he remember all your sacrifices. Or uh, Again, uh, just a blessing. Give the blessing. Whoever the, uh, the other people is. Could be the king Saul. Could be just the, his people. He is blessing his people. That's another possibility. Again, I did not say it. Uh, it could be uh, he's blessing his people. May the God bless you, whatever you sacrificed, and answer your uh, prayers. Um, may he give you the desire of your heart and make all your plans succeed. Again, it's a blessing for whoever they are, or he is, or they are. Uh, he will shout for joy when you are uh, We will shout for joy when you are victorious. Uh, and we will lift up our banner in the name of our God. Or this probably is uh, before the big battle, he is blessing his general. Uh, 
we will shout for joy when you you are victor victorious and we lift our banners in the name of God. We will celebrate if you win the battle. May the Lord grant all your requests. May the Lord grant you all your requests again the blessing. Now I know that the Lord saves his anointed. He answers him from his holy heaven. He's uh, now I know that the Lord saves his anointed, either him or Saul. From the history, we know the Lord anointed two kings. Uh, one is Saul, one is him. So we're not sure which one he refers to. He answers him from his holy heaven um, with the uh, saving power of his right hand. Uh, so this is uh, very, from my guessing, very likely he's uh, blessing uh, or praise or singing the song for Saul to please him, to make him happy, to comfort him. Um, because uh, now I know that the Lord saves his anointed and answers him from his own heaven with the saving power of his right hand. Or he refers to himself, I give my blessing to you and the Lord bless me. And I give my blessing to you. It's also possible. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of our, of the Lord our God. See, some trust in the uh, the force, the military force, the chariots, and also the horses. The uh, the battle in the battlefield, they trust the military uh, force. But I trust in the name of the Lord our God. I have the belief, even though I do not, or we do not have the chariots and the horses compared to the Philistine. Remember, we do not have the giant, but we have our faith and our God is with us because the, the war, the fight is righteous in God's eye, in God's eyes. So they are brought to their knees and the fall, but we rise up and stand firm. O oh Lord, save the king, answer us. When we call, see, oh Lord, save the king. If it's him, then he probably just say, "Oh God, please save me," like previously, uh, bless me, bless my people. But now he said, "May Lord save the king." Answer us when we call. Very like his comfort Saul, save him and save his, um, uh, be with his army to the battlefield, and uh, we will shout loud, uh, in your name, to uh celebrate victory victorious um, so this is uh, the um the psalm 20 very short uh, again we do not know what circumstances either um he's blessing his people as a king or he's just uh, uh singing this to saul to comfort him to um uh, to uh, bless him also ask god to bless him uh, so just wishes, may you be uh, this, may you be that, so that's just wishes. Um, I Like, I will pray our God for you to protect you in many ways. Uh, so this is, um, uh, again, uh, this is Psalm 20 and looks like, it, uh, regardless who is he's talking to, either the king, Saul, or his people, he has a heart to, to be with, with the other, whoever the, the other person is um, to ask and also he put God on the first place the highest so if you say so if you win the battle the war come back we will uh, uh, sing loud for you but in the name of God so if you win it's not you or me but it's just our God um, so this is a uh, uh, this is a, it again saying his um, heart of passion, give blessings to people wherever it is, um, and ask God to protect the other person or the other or his army, his general or his king, and to bless his king. Oh Lord, save the king, answer us when we call. We all call for you to save our king, either himself or King Saul. Very likely it's the other one. Um, the 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 uh, King Saul is is what he's trying to. Oh, ask God to bless him, bless his army, um, bless him and he and his people together to ask. Uh, again, this is just my guessing, could be wrong, but uh, if you know it, I'll be happy to, to hear and uh, to listen uh, what you think. And you can read it and interpret it in your way. Again, from this Psalm 20, we see um, the passion, uh, um, almost uh, 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 
just the very dedicated uh, heart to bless you fully, no matter who is. Um, I just ask you, ask God, uh, the Lord, I believe, to answer you, to protect you, to give you the victory. And um, we give, uh, eventually, if you win, we give this thanks not to anyone, not to you, not to me, but to the God. So again, this is the faith, and this is a, a very good way to bless people, bless others. And the last the conclude is, Lord, save the king, either him or King Saul. So this is a, an answer as we call, again, uh, relying the belief, whatever the God he believes. So this is Psalm 20. Um, uh, this, uh, again, in addition to the faith and the emotions, I think this is a, a very good poem um, uh, to remember, uh, to learn how to bless others and keep the heart to bless others in this way. Uh, so um, that's what I think. And you can read it and interpret it by yourself. And thank you for watching. Uh, I'll see you next time.